Good evening, I'm Leah Lando from 7 News and we are taking you through the 716 in two minutes. We are all paying a hefty price at the pump despite recent gas tax holidays that went into effect locally. The price for regular gas here in the Buffalo Niagara region is a record $4.90. That's nearly $2 more than it was this same time last year. The state and national average now both above $5 a gallon. If there's any silver lining, though, Western New York has the lowest prices in the state, as indicated by the dark blue coloring right there on the map. Areas in dark red and pink are above $5 a gallon. The 65th annual Allentown Art Festival wrapping up here in the Queen City. Hundreds of artists from across the country selling everything you can imagine, from paintings and photography to sculptures and jewelry. This is the first festival in three years because of the COVID-19 pandemic. Organizers say everything went according to plan. All right, let's check in with meteorologist Josh Nichols for a look at the forecast looking good. Yeah, looking pretty good, Leah. The showers fading, clouds will be on the decrease as we head into tonight. Tomorrow, nearly the picture of perfection for June. Similar story for Tuesday, and then the heat is on as we head into uh, the middle of the week. Temperatures are easily going to be climbing into the upper 80s. In the short term this evening, outside of a rogue shower, pretty much good to go. Still a lot of leftover cloudiness, but overnight, drier air will start to come in as the wind will shift ultimately into the north. The overnight low temperature at 55. Town by town we go. Your top temp in Aaronhurst for tomorrow, 75. We're at 73 in Clarence. And as we head up towards uh, Osei, Akron, Pendleton, low and mid-70 should do it for you as well. There is the super seven-day forecast. There's the warm-up starting on Tuesday. Could get an isolated thunderstorm. And there's the big-time heat for the middle of the week as highs are back into the upper 80s.